Sagittarius, it's L here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Sag with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, Sagittarius, I'm smiling from ear to ear because you guys have the best reading. All right, so most of your cards are about love, okay? And two of the cards are about love, engagement, and marriage, okay? Um, let's see how you're coming into the reading is the earth guardian so it talks about needing to ground yourself i mean just being swept off your feet with love uh, being swept off your feet with romance to the point where you just need to take a minute take a step back um don't jump out the window completely for this person or this relationship uh, though things are going very well very promising still ground the energy ground it in something that um is firm that is true that you can always go back to okay um a new romantic cycle is happening for you it could be with a libra or this could just be a very um interesting fair uh relationship it's a relationship where you don't feel like you have to do much for it you know it's a relationship where again marriage uh engagement you know, it could be in the cards for you. It says pay attention to your appearance, but don't be too much about appearances. Also, a legal matter could go away for you at this time. Um, it's, it's asking you to feel more and think less. There is love here. Um, and it's making you feel kind of like you're floating on a cloud. Like it's making you feel as if uh, your head is in the clouds. Um, maybe you're not as grounded as you used to be. Um, someone could just be really expressing to you how much they appreciate you. They appreciate the relationship, how much they are in love with you, how much they are in love with you. No, not just sexually how you look, but just you. Um, the bare bones of you, your personality, everything you have to offer. So this is a very, very good reading. This is how you feel about someone else. It could be mutually beneficial. The Libra talks about fairness, justice. It talks about balance. So this could just be, um, again, a very balanced relationship here. It also, this card also says, reach out to someone and let them know you care, all right? If some of you have not done that, because there's still a lot of love between the two of you. Um, what's coming in your near future? Two cards want to come out for you. Sudden wealth and, and wealthy man. So you got wealth coming up twice. Wealth and sudden wealth and then wealthy man. So it looks like this could definitely be a very... Um, a very wealthy marriage, a very wealthy partnership where things just go well. Again, a lot of balance, balancing each other out. It makes sense. You guys are on the right page, the, the right wavelength. Um, there's a lot of compromise. It's um, working well together. You could even be dealing with someone who's younger than you, um, but very well established, an entrepreneur, someone who's about business, has a lot of business acumen about themselves. Maybe either will help you in your business or vice versa. Um, you help them. Um, suddenly, you feel a lot of love, a lot of loving vibes for this person. Um, I feel like this is a woman meeting a man. It could be the other way around, but a lot of the cards are lending towards a woman meeting a man, okay? Um, or a feminine energy meeting a man. So if it's two men, one of the men could be feminine, the other could be masculine. And if it's two women, then one is feminine, one is masculine, right? So um, a feminine energy meeting a masculine energy, okay? Again, <laughs> another card of just love love is in the air for you sad romance it's all working out well for you um it says that a relationship again could go to marriage um you know if you're questioned about this relationship if you're questioning this relationship this current relationship um just uh expect you guys to become closer if you had any qualms or, or just uh, disagreements and just expect all of that to just fade away is you know trust that you guys are going to grow together um the relationship yeah of course it has peaks and valleys but you guys are going to get through it um this could even be recommitting yourself 
to your current partner if you are already married or coupled it, it's just like falling in love all over again just have faith that love is coming your way if you are not in love and just have faith that if you are in love if you are in a, an established relationship things are getting better let's pull some tarot cards for you and then we'll get out of here let's see what the tarot has to say for Sag, what does the tarot has to say? What does the tarot have to say? Okay, the king of pentacles. So you got a, a king with some money, a man with some money here again. So you got somebody here who's ready to be a husband. They may not be as romantic if they are the king of pentacles, but maybe they'll try. They definitely will be a provider. You'll be well provided for what you need will be, you know, there for you and a lot of what you want. Um this person is well established again they give very good uh advice okay let's see three of pentacles again you working well together because there's the masculine and the feminine energy and the divine holding you two together and we talked about masculine and feminine energy so it's like you guys work well together you even don't knowing that it's time to do something big with this person it's time to make uh, the, the next step or take the next step make the move here and that could be towards engagement moving in together um you get it they get it it's time okay let's it, it's time for, to, for it's time for something to be solidified with all these pentacles here and with the earth guardian showing up all right last card for sagittarius what do we have to tell sag you have the best reading sag Oh, wow. The page of wands. It looks like you guys are going to explore. You're dating. You're having fun, living life on your own terms. Could even be experiencing maybe lap of luxury. The page of wands dresses nice, you know, back to appearances. Take time on your appearance. This is a renewed sense of self. This is someone that you've met. Uh, they, they check all boxes. Um, things are going well again uh, again good news on the horizon for you and this person uh, sexual energy is high here also the sex could be good it, it also talks about ground the relationship in something um, stable because it could dissipate it could go away just as quickly as it started so make sure that it's grounded in something a little more than just sexual activity okay wow another card of proposal um, marriage of choosing you of winning six of wands at the bottom of the deck this is what i have for you sad congratulations you've got so much um confirmation here um if it resonates for you let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section go over to the website book to see if this is your reading you know if uh, engagement is coming in for you you can also catch me live every tuesday thursday and sunday night 9 30 p.m eastern standard time thank you sagittarius take care many blessings